Hello, welcome to how to solve this very nice square root math simplification problem. Square root of 2 plus the square root of 3 plus the square root of 4 plus the square root of 6 divided by square root of 1 plus the square root of 3 plus the square root of 8. First of all, we suppose that uh, this expression is equal to x. So, x is equal to square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus this is square root of 4 can be written as a square root of 2 times 2 plus this is square root of 6 can be written as a square root of 2 times 3 divided by this is square root of 1 is 1 plus square root of 3 plus this is square root of 4 can be written as square root of 4 times 2. X, X is equal to square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus by using this property square root of A times B is equal to square root of A times square root of B. This is square root of 2 times 2 will become square root of 2 times square root of 2 plus this is square root of 2 times 3 will become square root of 2 times square root of 3 divided by 1 plus square root of 3 plus this is square root of 4 times 2 will become square root of 4 times square root of 2. Next, x is equal to square root of 2 plus square root of 3. From these two terms, we can factor out square root of 2 plus square root of 2 as common factor and in bracket left square root of 2 plus square root of 3 divided by 1 plus square root of 3 plus this is square root of 4 is 2 times square root of 2. Next, x is equal to, now from here we can factor out square root of 2 plus square root of 3 from here square root of 2 plus square root of 3 as common factor and in bracket left in bracket left 1 plus square root of 2 divided by 1 plus square root of 3 plus this is 2 times square root of 2 2 times square root of 2 can be written as a square root of 2 plus square root of 2. So, we write this 2 times square root of 2 as square root of 2 plus square root of 2. Next, x is equal to 1 plus square root of 2 times square root of 2 plus square root of 3 divided by we make a group of uh, this one and this uh, square root of 2. So, 1 plus uh, square root of 2, we use parenthesis to make it a group plus and we make uh, another group of uh, this uh, square root of 2 plus uh, square root of 3. Square root of 2 plus uh, square root of 3. Now, we suppose that let a is equal to 1 plus uh, square root of 2 and b is equal to square root of 2 plus square root of 3. If we substitute a and b in this equation, then this equation will become x is equal to a times b divided by a plus b. Now, if we take a reciprocal on both sides, then 1 over x will be equal to a plus b divided by 
a times b this implies that 1 over x is equal to a over a b plus b over a b now this a will be cancelled out with this a and here left 1 and this b will be cancelled out with this b and here left 1 so this equation will become 1 over x is equal to 1 over b plus 1 over a next 1 over x is equal to now we replace this b with this square root of 2 plus square root of 3 and we replace this a with this 1 plus square root of 2 then this expression will become 1 divided by square root of 2 plus square root of 3 plus 1 divided by 1 plus square root of 2 next 1 over x is equal to 1 divided by this is square root of 2 plus square root of 3 is same as square root of 3 plus square root of 2 and to rationalize the denominator we multiply and we divide this expression by the conjugate of this square root of 3 plus square root of 2 the conjugate is square root of 3 minus square root of 2 divided by square root of 3 minus square root of 2 plus 1 divided by this 1 plus square root of 2 can be written as square root of 2 plus 1 and to rationalize the denominator we multiply and divide this expression by the conjugate of this square root of 2 plus 1 the conjugate is square root of 2 minus 1 divided by square root of 2 minus 1 next 1 over x is equal to 1 divided by this expression square root of 3 minus square root of 2 divided by by using this uh, algebraic identity a plus b times a minus b is equal to a squared minus b squared this uh, square root of 3 plus square root of 2 times uh, square root of 3 minus uh, square root of 2 will become square root of 3 squared minus square root of 2 squared plus 1 time this expression square root of 2 minus 1 divided by by using this identity this square root of 2 plus 1 times the square root of 2 minus 1 will become square root of 2 squared minus 1 squared next 1 over x is equal to square root of 3 minus square root of 2 divided by this square will be cancelled out with this square root and this square will be cancelled out with this square root and 3 minus 2 is 1 plus square root of 2 minus 1 divided by this square will be cancelled out with this square root and 1 squared is 1 so this 2 minus 1 is 1 next 1 over x is equal to now we write the common denominator 1 we write common denominator 1 and this is square root of 3 minus square root of 2 will come here square root of 3 minus square root of 2 plus this square root of 2 minus 1 now this uh, positive square root of 2 will be cancelled out with this negative square root of 2 and here we are left with the 1 over x is equal to square root of 3 minus 1 divided by 1 now to find the value of x so we take a reciprocal on both sides so x is equal to 1 divided by square root of 3 minus 1 and to rationalize the denominator we multiply and divide this expression by the conjugate of this square root of 3 minus 1 
the conjugate is the square root of 3 plus 1 divided by square root of 3 plus 1. Next, x is equal to 1 time this expression square root of 3 plus 1 divided by by using this algebraic identity a minus b times a plus b is equal to a squared minus b squared. This is square root of 3 minus 1 times the square root of 3 plus 1 will become square root of 3 squared minus 1 squared. Next, x is equal to square root of 3 plus 1 divided by this square will be cancelled out with this square root and 3 minus 1 is 2. This is the final value of x. This is the final answer of this problem.